Hi everybody, I wanted to drop in here and introduce you to a new member of the family, which is little Tommy Turbo. Ow, ow, ow. he's a bit painful. He's 12 weeks old and he's a little Jack Russell and he's a ball of fun and teeth. But he eats socks mainly and uh, everything, absolutely everything. Actually, one good thing about having a puppy is the kids pick up their toys now because if they don't, it gets eaten and possibly thrown away anyway. But yeah, I got a puppy because they all say that you should go out walking, um, get lots of exercise after cancer and things. What, what, why are you all alert? He's all alert. I feel like something's about to happen. <laughs> what, what? I know. Um, so they say get out and walk, which I was doing, but I felt like a right weirdo walking around with no dog. Who walks with no dog? It's fine to walk without a dog, honestly. It was just a good excuse to get one. Whoa. Must be a cat. Um, rabbit doesn't like him. The rabbit ran when they first met. So now the rabbit's fun to chase. So we need to split those two up all the time, but that's okay. Uh, the cat's getting there, but yeah, I thought it would be a good burst of feel-good uh, energy around the house. Um, gives a good burst of good hormones, happy hormones. He's fun. He's good for the kids. He picks up all the uh, food off the floor. And he's just, it'll be nice to be able to get out and about with him and take him places where we can go walking. And he's just good fun, aren't you? Aren't you, Tommy? Yeah, yeah, it's a bit, a bit painful to stroke because he bites all the time. But we'll get there, won't we? And we'll stop weeing on the floor soon, won't we? Yeah, be fine. Yeah, ouch. Yeah, it's very relaxing to stroke because he bites everything. But this is Tommy, 12 weeks old. I'll show you him to... Ow. As he grows up, I'll show him to you more. This is him. He was a lot smaller when we got him. Oh gosh. Um, my son's best friend got a puppy. Well, it was their fault we got him at all, actually. Um, and they said, Can we just see the puppies on the way home? And so uh, I thought I'd be stronger than I was. And I was looking, I wanted a dog, but I wanted a bigger dog because small dogs, I read in one of my cancer books that small dogs and children take energy, whereas big dogs. And horses give energy. So I was like, all right, well, I need a horse and a dog. Big dog. I end up with no horse and a small dog. Rubbish. Um, and I went with my best, well, they are our best friends and my son's best friend. We're all best friends. And we went with them and they said, can we just see the puppies on the way home? And I was like, yeah, I want a big dog anyway, so I'll be strong. Don't worry about me. And then I walked in and he, he was eight weeks old at that point. And he went, no. He was four weeks old at that point, and I was like, oh no, it's going to happen, isn't it? It's going to happen. There was no getting out of there with no puppy. Um, I can call you Jaws, Nipper. But, yes, yeah, so it was their fault. It wasn't, it wasn't, it, I was a moment of weakness, but I'm happy. I'm happy we got him. My clothes and socks and slippers aren't happy we got him, but um, stop eating me. I fully recommend it. Maybe get one that's got corks on his teeth or something. Bit less painful. But anyway, yes. Fully recommend it. Uh, wanted to introduce you to him. I shall see you in the next one.